So this is a quick video to show you basically how to sign up through the Move Eat Re-Energize Hub and start doing some of these training programs. Uh, so, go to the website and pick which one that feels right for you to do right now. So I'm going to do the body weight 5 minute movement snacks and click on click here and I'll up, up. Just let it load up and then put in your details you have. In the coaching, so the same one you signed up with originally. And a mail, your phone number. Yep. The same password you used to sign up. If you don't remember, let me know. I'll reset it for you. And there. And time zone, it tells you there, we are plus 11. Once Dallas Sands finishes, we are plus 10, so it should change back. And go create account. I know it sounds weird like to create account, but basically, if your account is going to populate it for you. Thank you for signing up, and you can log in. But basically, after that, just close it. And then, when you log into your, it looks kind of like this. Some of you, this is back in for me. To thing, thing. You'll go to your programs. It's the easiest way to play every day when you come to your program and have a look at it. There is the body movement movements. If you remember, pop heroes. Got a pen. So day one, it's an ascent. So it's push ups as many as possible. AAP stands for get that in one minute. So as many push ups as you can in one minute, and as many body weight squats as you can in one minute. Remember, these are just templates. If you can't do these movements, let me know and I'll give you an alternative. But you do as many reps as you can, rest a minute, do as many reps as you can, rest a minute, and that is it. So I would write down push ups. And then score, and then body weight squat and score. So I can go away later on the day and just do it whenever I feel like it. And then come back later in the day to put it in. Hot tip when you look at this, especially these body weight five minute movement stacks, when you look at it in the morning to see when you can plan into the day, there's a thing I've been doing lately, probably the last two weeks, as things have been getting more stressful around the world, is to excuse. Effort and get straight. That sparks up and makes you get in and do it. The five second rule, five, four, three, two, one, and to just do whatever it is. Like this test will take, this will take three minutes. Two minutes of work, one minute of rest. You don't need to warm up for it. It's whatever you can do right now. So that is the most important thing with online stuff and doing stuff at home. Really small doses throughout the day is the way to do it. Trying to do an hour at home is going to be really hard if you've got kids like we do. So Kat and I have just chunked down our stuff to 5 minutes to 10 minutes if we feel like we've got heaps of time when the kids are asleep. But generally, 5 minutes and even less than that if we need to just to get something in. So start small. When you when you are looking at your phone doing it, it means you have time right now to do one of these 5-minute movement stacks and just go effort and just get in and do it straight away. That's the best way to do it. And at home, it's the pretty much the only way to do it because... There's going to be lots of things taking, like distracting you from doing what you want to do. Like there's dishes in the sink I'm going to go do in a second. There's lawns I've got to mow and 
there's a guard I've got to clean up to make sure we'll be able to work at home when the eventual lockdown happens. All that kind of stuff is going to distract you. Let's try and tick these movement things off straight away. And just get in and get it done. That's how you sign up these movement snacks, and this is how I would do it. So you sign up, fill it out, fill in the form, get access, then go in and have a look and see what it is to do today. Write down the piece of paper, plan when you're going to do it, or just say effort and do it straight away, or whatever word sparks you to do it. And then write down your results and add it into the app later. Always start small. It should always be like a like it feels like it's stupid. It's so easy. It's stupid. That's a good point to be at. It means you're going to probably get in and do it. All right. Throw me some comments if you've got any questions. Some more are coming. I'm going to rock workout today. So if you find a rock or a um, piece of firewood, you do a workout with that. All right. See ya.